elves weren't always split between light and dark. This statue depicts the elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the light. Teal, yavaş yavaş, hani düzelecek gibi mi geliyor ama nasıl savaşacak? Hikayede bir boss fight'ın içine dalacak mı diye de ayrıca merak ediyorum. Şimdi elf diyarına gelmiştik en son. Bakalım neler olacak. Above the door, there's a light crystal. Weird. That usually works. Maybe it needs some extra. Yes, I see now. The Twilight Stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. What's that sound? No sense in spoiling the surprise. It's the light. I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye, Fimble Winter, you reckon? Of course, making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After the creation of the Nine Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus, the Light Elves were born. I imagine our light elf friends will be less than pleased. <laughs> Speaking of light elves, let me try talking to them again. They may just to let these two do their thing. <laughs> 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 have an idea to get us across. <laughs> Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some architecture. This way. The shrine awaits. <laughs> The temple looks so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. These elves use Alfheim's light to enhance the temple, <laughs> and themselves by the look of it. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the Dark Elves want with it? To return it back to its source. 
To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred. None more so than the light itself. Aye. The light elf success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. There's more Twilight Stone up there. That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. <laughs> Gotta be a better angle on that twilight. More light elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. There, friends, salutations. We mean you no harm. Tear. Scalper! Get back. Watch your life. I tried. I get it now. Why they keep fighting? Dark elves want the souls in the light left alone. But the light elves want to keep using them. That's the long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? Rarely is it so simple. And not our place to say. This is an elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alfheim. Right. They sure made a lot of these light doors. Hmm. Fortifications. Aye. None too eager to let the Dark Elves run the roost again. Let's continue our ascent, yes? Another of Cavassia's poems. Yeah! 
I suppose I'll leave you to it then. Another wide out! To the left! on the other side. Whoa! Tyr can really jump. That's the wrong... No, I see. Another check. He's getting the hang of it. I've never seen the Light Elves with so much control over the temple. Guess that's on us. They must have anointed a new temple guardian. Spartal Yoffer's counterpart. The Dark Elf King. Guess he's in the light now, too. Ah, I see. The timing must be precise. See us. There's twilight stone on the ground. We can continue up this way. Father, over here. Here they come. 
Do what you must. What you right? figure out how they're making light bridges look at this statue these crystals I've noticed them on the elves as well I wonder if this statue were to fall over the chasm Yeah, look. The foundation's weak. Father could push this over no problem. Oh! The crystals still make light bridges. Now the light helps wear them. Smart. Almost there. Allow me. I dare say he's beginning to enjoy the vandalism. Pretty soon he'll be laying waste to pottery. Shall we continue? Well, at least we're getting closer. Look up. See? It feels even taller on the inside. Can't believe all this was down here.
tighter than I remember. <clears throat> Another light door. There's some twilight stone on that statue shield. But that angle isn't gonna work. Do you think there's any way to stop the elves from fighting each other? Had Freyr not abandoned the realm, a lasting peace may have formed. But now... Can we really place all the blame on Freyr? This war started long before his arrival. But he had the power to heal this land and end the war, did he not? He made his choice. The wrong one. For our fight, perhaps. But not necessarily for him. Well, I suppose we're all entitled to walk our own path. Regardless. Halen taşı görmedi mi? Stuck on the wing. Connor is the privileges, man. Father, up there.
Father, up there. That looks right. Bu da çok saçma oldu. Here, the last time we were here, we killed the dark elf. That's unfortunate. I'd wondered what became of Svartli Offer. We had to defend ourselves, but when he died, he told us we helped the wrong side. I see. You climbed on like this. Çok saçma oldu. Yani Balta darbesi de koca heykeli fena ittirdi. Do you still hear something wounded out there, Atreus? I think so. It could just be the storm. Perhaps we can investigate. Once we've uncovered a mysterious seer's hidden prophecy. There, the central chamber will bring us to the top. Once we find it. some soundstone up there. It pairs quite nicely with the Twilight Stone. A knack for interiors, these light elves. Maybe if we allow me to speed this up. The angle should work, Kratos. Well done. At your service. Ah, the light of Alfheim. How stunning. What's wrong? I could hear mother inside last time, but I can't anymore. Her soul is one with the light now, united by forces older than Odin himself. She is at peace, Atreus. I hope so. When father went inside the light, he you said went he... inside the light of Alfheim? Yes. And yet here you stand, of sound mind and decidedly not incinerated. You must tell me, Kratos, what did you see? That memory is for me alone. But I felt only moments pass. Didn't feel like moments to me. I was trapped. Atreus overcame great odds to save me. One could but only imagine. Well then, Groa's triptych awaits. So, did you ever meet Groa? Many times. But she was plagued by constant visions, so... Conversation was... Difficult, to say the least.
you doing? Father, she's... she's gone. Evet arkadaşlar, Kratos'un yaşlılığının ispatı bu andır. We're almost there. Huh? They've changed some stuff. Last time, there was all this hive stuff up here. So many dark elves. I. All this time, I thought the dark elf king. I thought all the dark elves were. Here? Yes. Did we help the wrong side? Hmm. Are you certain that's the right question? I... What's the right question? Is there a right side? Exactly. What do you think, Atreus? Is there a right side in this war? I... I don't know. Then perhaps you shouldn't pick one. Giants always did enjoy hiding their secrets in plain sight. Wait until you see this. Ah, yes. Here we have Groa's search for her missing husband. She was relentless in her attempt to find him. Meditated for weeks on end. Unfortunately, she found... something else. A vision of Ragnarok. The word of Groa's vision reached Odin. He sought her out. Demanded a private retelling. Didn't like what he had, apparently. Ironwood? That's the... I don't know what that is. The mythical sanctuary for giants. Curious. So it's in Jotunheim? I know some giants thought so. But Ironwood isn't anywhere, lad. It's a concept. A metaphorical paradise. It's not real. Presumably, Groa requested her ashes be returned to Jotunheim, while her soul found peace in the life. Difficult to imagine Odin respecting those wishes. Hmm. The champion? I think it's supposed to be... Me. You assume too much. Aye. Best not to read into these abstractions so literally. Prophecies are slippery by nature. Although some are more obvious than others. Ragnarok. Aye. The end of everything. So this is it. There's nothing we can do to stop it. There must be a way. Why else is this hidden? Look. Here. This is what we saw. It's you. Fighting in Ragnarok. No. I don't. I can't. What's this then? That's new. Asgard is destroyed? But the other realms thrive?
she lied. Roa lied? Of course she did. <laughs> Odin's working off a false prophecy. <laughs> so then, we can win Ragnarok. We can beat Odin. We are not present in any of this. But that was Tyr leading the charge against Asgard. Plus, Hell's army was there. And the elves. Champion. Okay, whoever that is, doesn't matter. But for the first time, we know something Odin doesn't. We just saw we can win. Tyr? I won't allow prophecy to define my choices. But, but we just saw no, you. No, Atreus. This is wrong. Come. There is much to discuss. It is time. God of War created. We can't stop Ragnarok. But we can win it. If Asgard is destroyed, Odin will not be the only casualty. There must be another way. Odin'in bir nevi bir kehanet öğrenmiş olduk. Bir ihtimal var. Tyr de kendi içinde e, Odin'e bulaşmama kararındaydı işkenceden sonra. Halen savaşmıyor. Ufak tefek yardım ediyor. Şimdi önümüzdeki süreçte düşünecek ne yapacağını. Biz de arada adam bir çevirecek. Rezervist yapacak bir şey yok. Destek için beğenip abone olmayı unutmayın. Sonraki bölümde kaldığımız yerden devam edeceğiz.